Hello geniuses. Auntie Katie has asked me to record this song for you because she knows that I have the voice of an angel. Okay? When we were little girls in school and we were practicing how to count, we would sing. So I want you to sing along with me from one through a hundred. Okay, here goes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1 and 20, 2 and 20, 3 and 4 and 5 and 6 and 20, 27, 28, 29, 30, 1 and 30, 2 and 30, 3 and 4 and 5 and 6 and 30, 37, 38, 39, 40, 1 and 40, 2 and 40, 3 and 4 and 5 and 6 and 40, 47, 48, 49, 50, 1 and 50, 2 and 50, 3 and 4 and 5 and 6 and 50, 57, 58, 59, 60, 1 and 60, 2 and 60, 3 and 4 and 5 and 6 and 60, 67, 68, 69, 70, 1 and 70, 2 and 70, 3 and 4 and 5 and 6 and 70 77 78 79 80 1 and 80 2 and 80 3 and 4 and 5 and 6 and 80 87 88 89 90 1 and 90 2 and 90 3 and 4 and 5 and 6 and 90 97 98 99 100 you did it little geniuses <laughs> now my geniuses you would have heard that number song a while ago and i want you to learn that song so practice it when i went to school that was something that i enjoyed doing my teacher used to play it for me before every math class right and i would be so excited about learning about math so i hope that it will be the same for you. There is also a game that we played outside using that same song and I wanted to bring it to life and share it with you. So my geniuses, I hope that you enjoyed it. I want to thank Ruthana for singing it for me because you know my voice sounds like a frog is stuck in my throat. Yes, I am not a great singer and you have to be able to tell your strengths and your weaknesses so as such, my geniuses, if you're not good at something, it's okay to have someone that is good at it, do it for you. And in this case, Ritharna is a great singer. So Miss Kennedy, thank you, okay? All right, guys, so today we are looking at numbers and their names. Yes, I am not teaching you math. I am still teaching you reading. I am teaching you ELA, the English language arts, right? But for you to be even greater at reading, you need to be able to identify your numbers, right? So you need to see the words and you know that definitely that is the word. So who better to teach it to you than moi, me, so here I am. All right, guys, I should have started at zero though, so I'm gonna put zero here for you, okay? A zero is very important when you are counting. So here, look at them for me, please. Look at their words, all right? I'll call them three times for you. I'll call them three times for you. Is that okay? All right, sure. So we have zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Now, you would have realized that I did not write 21, right? And it is for a reason, because if you know 20 and you know one, then you'll just put them together and you'll get 21. See that, my geniuses? And it's the same thing, so 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 
29, and then I have 30 there on the board. See what I did? You genius, you. All right, so 30, and it's the same principle that applies. So you'll go 31 here, and it continues until you're at 39, and then you'll go 40, 50, so after 40, when you're at 49, then you'll go 50, right? And when you're at 59, so you'll go 51, 52, until you're at 59. When you're at 59, you'll go 60, and then it continues. 61, 62, so as long as you know how to come from one to nine, then you are great. You will have no problem with numbers. So there you go 59, then you'll have 60. Once you go to 69, then you go to 70. And then it continues, 79, you'll go to 80. 89, you'll go to 90. And then 99, you'll go to 100. 100, and one is there already. So if you want to continue counting, continue counting, you know, once you know these words, then you will have no problem with numbers, all right? And by the time you get to thousands, oh, voila, that will be a piece of cake for you, right? Because you already know letter sounds, so you know how to identify them by putting the sounds together. So you know the thousands, you'll know the hundred thousand, the ten thousand, the million, right? Yes, will be nothing for you, piece of cake. All right, so let me call them. Now that you understand the sequence in which I was going, let me call these for you. So we have zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty, thirty, forty. 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, all right? So here goes again, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, all right, 100. Now guys, are you ready to do an activity for me? Yes, I am going to give you an activity with just numbers, but you will have to put the words on the line to complete the sentences, all right? You're ready? I am ready too. Okay, my geniuses, so now you are going to match these numbers to their names for me. So one is here. Where would you find this over here? You have 75. Where would you find that word? Zero? Come on, you can do this. 40? Go ahead, identify that for me. So you can copy these in your journals, or you can just write the number and the names in the comment section for me. Okay, nine, match that. So if you're doing it in your journal, you can go ahead and draw the lines, all right? Or you can just write it beside it for me. Either way, that's acceptable. Now, for these at the bottom, after nine is blank. Put the word there for me, okay? 28 comes before what? 11 comes before blank. After 99 is blank. You got that, my geniuses? I hope that you enjoyed my lesson today. I hope you enjoyed my little song and it will be stuck in your brain and it makes it so easy to count to 100 because sometimes even adults have problems 
knowing what comes next. But with the song in your brain, you'll never forget. And you'll never forget how to spell these numbers because it's easy to make mistakes with them. And we all make mistakes, right? So once you make mistakes, it's okay, guys. It's just that from you know how to correct it, then you would have grown. And that's what I want for you, my geniuses. Guys, I want to thank you for joining me on Reading Unlimited with KDN. I want to thank you for liking and for subscribing. Please comment so I can hear from you. That's the only way I can hear from you and I love hearing from you, okay guys? So please go ahead and comment and like for me. So once you watch that video, just hit that thumbs up button for me, okay? Now guys, have you been looking in that mirror? Have you been telling yourself great things? You're awesome, you're stunning, you're beautiful, you're gorgeous, you're wonderful. Have you been kind to yourself? I hope so, but in so doing, be kind to others. And if you have nothing good to say about people, please say absolutely nothing at all. Please remember to join me on my live Fridays at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. There I will get to know you more and we will have loads of fun and giveaways. Okay, my geniuses, now I want you to have yourselves a great day. Bye.